Welcome to another presentation from Online Horse College. This is the final goal setting video, um, the final one of three. And before we even start this video, we'll just go through a checklist. The first video was about writing goals and using the smarter method to write the goals. So you should have already seen that video, written your goals out correctly and then gone on to the next video which is preparation of plans to achieve those goals so if you haven't already seen those two videos it's probably a good idea that you see those before you go on and, and um, do this final video the final video is about taking action so we talk about on your mark get set and go but it really is the final step the thing that you need to achieve to, um, to do to achieve your goals when we talk about on your mark it's a matter of asking yourself a question. What is stopping you from taking the first step right here, right now? Now it could be that you're sitting at home in your pajamas and you're ready for bed and you, you're just saying, look, it's just not feasible that I go out and start my yearly training program um, riding my horse tonight. But you could say organize a riding lesson with your instructor within the first couple of weeks just to make sure you're on track and headed towards your goals. That's one thing that you could do right here, right now. If you're ready to enroll in a program, you could go ahead and enroll in that program right here or study course right here, right now. So there are some things that you can do right here, right now. You could need, you may need to look up the internet for something just to finalize your plan. So that's the first thing that you need to do and that's about taking action and making sure you do it. The next one is to get set and to mentally prepare yourself. Now we've got another um, video on visualization and using your visualization skills to achieve um, to achieve your goals. So if you haven't seen that, make sure you see that and um, make sure that you do visualize your goal in the positive. So visualize yourself that you've already achieved the goal and it really does help you with some um, intrinsic motivation towards achieving that goal if you go through that process. So that's probably the second thing and if you haven't, if it's if you haven't done the first one, go ahead and do that. If you've already done your preparation, even if you have done some visualization, it's a good idea to do that as soon as you finish this video. And the third thing is to remember once you've started to go through the process is to do something every day. Now, it could be a matter of having a dressage test in your pocket and having a couple of, couple of minutes spare. Um, even if you're right away from horses, pull out your dressage test and make sure you go through and learn that. It could be a matter of um, just spending a moment to close your eyes and visualize writing that test or visualize doing that extra little bit of study or learning or visualize riding around that cross-country course or giving that lesson. So just do something every day and even if it is a small thing when you're not able to ride, not able to do the physical things, to achieve your goals. Remember, just do something working towards them. And the other thing is too, that when you have milestones that you have achieved a certain um, a certain step, particularly if you achieve it, you know, you might have planned to achieve right at a certain level and all of a sudden you've gone to a competition, you've ju been judged quite well and you've achieved that goal ahead of schedule. Reward yourself for that. But remember, there's a couple of things. There's two things you need to do. Every decision that you make, ask yourself, is this the correct decision to help me achieve my goal? Is this helping me achieve my goal or is it taking me further away from the goal? So if there's a movie on this weekend and you want to go and see it with your friends, is this taking me towards my goal or away from my goal? Should I um, be at a competition or at a training venue or something that's going to help me towards my goal or away from my goal? Um, everything, every decision that you make, ask yourself, if it's a bit neutral, well, go ahead and, and do that decision. But if it's taking you away from your goal, then you almost need to take two steps towards your goal to make that up. And is it easier just to take steps towards your goal rather than away? Okay, now remember the main thing is do something at least every day. More often is better, small steps, and um, go ahead and achieve those goals.
This has been another presentation from Online Horse College.